Um, what's the urgent problems of transgender persons in Venezuela? As uh, in every other country, the main uh, problem that, that actually affects trans people in Venezuela is the lack of identity. Uh, you in Germany know very well what a wall means and what is uh, to be treated as a non-citizen in your own country. Uh, this is what happens actually with trans people in most of, uh, of, of the world, but particularly in Venezuela where you don't have the right to change your name nor your gender in any of your identity papers. So um, you become a kind of paria in your own country and lacking of legal identity, you're not entitled uh, to exert your citizenship uh, on equal uh, conditions as the rest of the population. Particularly, you're excluded from the uh, economic system, labor. Uh, you are excluded from education. You're excluded from housing. And uh, uh, you're denied of uh, most of, of the most simple uh, rights that any citizen uh, has for granted and do not think too much about them as, as a problem. Uh, so uh, this is the very first uh, problem and of course from lack of identity and the lack of respect for trans community, uh, many other arise. Hate crimes, situations relating to discrimination uh, at the schools, um, at, uh, at, the, at the work and everywhere and in general lack of any health policy devoted at or aiming at render services, health services to trans people. Okay, and how could advance the situation of transgender persons in Venezuela? Um, I think uh, we need a courageous policies as other countries in the region have included, from the legal point of view and from the point of view of public policies. From the legal point of view, uh, we should include a uh, um, matter or legal matter to uh, request for the change of your identity in an expedite manner and preserving your confidentiality and uh, the right of privacy. Uh, that should be a must and it's very easy to be done with a little of uh, good faith uh, from the from uh, legislators. Uh, as it was done in Mexico, in uh, uh, Uruguay, in Ecuador, in um, other countries also where they are discussing this kind of law, such as Argentina, or where uh, the jurisprudence has been courageous and granting identity, such as Colombia, Ecuador, or Brazil. Uh, it's unfortunate to say that Venezuela is in one of the last positions in this matter in the entire Latin America and we are sharing more places with Central America and Caribbean countries which are uh, go government and uh, dominated but very, um, very, very um, by forces that are uh, conservative. 